little pressure. Luck. All right. We're going to give you a chance to earn some spins for the final round, players. The more spins you earn, the better chance you have to win the game. Here's how this round works. I'm going to ask a question. The first player to buzz in will answer that question. That answer will become one of three choices for the remaining two players. A correct buzz in answer here gets you three spins. A correct multiple choice answer gets you one spin. All right? Here comes the first question. Good luck to the three. The terms arabesque and pirouette are traditionally associated with what activity? Grant. Ballet. Is it ballet, gymnastics, or figure skating? Terry. Ballet. Ballet. Sandy? Ballet. Sure, it is ballet. Yes, a nice pirouette. <laughs> Terry, you pick up a spin, go to one. Sandy, you get a spin as well. You're a one. And Grant, three spins for you. Next question. All Saints Day traditionally occurs the day after what holiday? Grant. Uh, Halloween. Is it Halloween, Easter, or St. Patrick's Day? Terry. Easter. Sandy? Halloween. It is Halloween, yes. <laughs> Terry, you stay at one. Sandy, another spin for you. Put you at two. And Grant, another three spins for you. You're up to six now. Players, if you bet on a racehorse to show, you're wagering that it will finish in at least Grant. Third. What position? First, second, or third? Terry. It's third. Third. Sandy? Third. Might as well go with the grain, right? It is third, yes. Terry, you pick up a spin, you're up to two. Sandy, another one for you gives you three. And Grant, another three spins, puts you up to nine now. Who was the first American president to speak on television? Sandy. John F. Kennedy. Was it John F. Kennedy, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, or Dwight D. Eisenhower? Terry. Eisenhower. Eisenhower. Grant? I'm going to go with Eisenhower. You know, it was Franklin Delano Roosevelt. FDR spoke at the opening of the New York World's Fair back in 1939. No spins to anyone that time around. All right, players, here's your final question. A cup, a liter, or a gallon? How much saliva does the average person produce in one day? Grant. Uh, a liter. Is it a cup, a liter, or a gallon? Terry? A gallon. Sandy? A cup. A cup? It's actually a liter. A liter, yeah. Grant, you pick up three more spins there. And at the end of the question round, Terry, you've got two. Sandy, you've got three. Grant, an unbelievable 12 spins. When we come back, we'll find out if those 12 spins help you or if they hurt it right after this. Don't go anywhere.